Brexit is happening. After a referendum, three Prime Ministers and two general elections, the UK is finally leaving the EU. But what does that mean here in Catalonia for businesses and for Brits living here? There's a transition period until the end of this year, so you won't notice many changes at first. But if you're a British national living in Catalonia, where can you get your Brexit questions answered? Barcelona City Council have set up a Punt Brexit or Brexit Information Point. Here, their aim is to offer businesses and people with face-to-face -face practical information and help them with any doubts or queries. We uh, inform them the, the, the kind of documents uh, or the procedures they have to uh, have uh, in order to guarantee all their rights. The British Consulate also provides information for Brits in Catalonia. In terms of trade, the UK is Catalonia's fifth largest partner, with exports worth 4 billion euros a year and imports worth 3 billion. Vehicle components and chemical products move both ways, with Catalan food products another major export. The government's trade agency, Axio, is helping businesses plan for Brexit. We think um, that in the short term, it will, it will have more negative effects um, than positive because companies will need to adapt. In the medium term, um, probably um, in places in the EU where Catalan companies were competing with British companies, maybe now they'll have a better ad an advantage. The government here is also preparing. They released a report saying that a no-deal Brexit at the end of the transition period could cost Catalonia up to 2 billion euros over five years. There would be a cost in terms of tourism and of course there would be a cost in terms of um, exports in the sense that, for example, um, our wine uh, is uh, very well regarded in the UK. So while some Brits might be popping a bottle of Catalan Cava to celebrate Brexit, there's still a lot of uncertainty ahead. <laughs>